Ladies and gentlemen, the glitch mob. The glitch mob. This is that future shit. This is that next level shit. West Coast. Blowing out the sound system. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the Alright guys, so basically, I've had these JBL D130 15 inch, uh, I guess they're full range, they're not really, they don't extend that high, but uh, speakers for, well, honestly I've had them for, well, before this channel, before this YouTube channel even started, um, but I never really got around to making a video of them until today uh which is kind of interesting um anyways basically these used to be my grandfather's and he was an audiophile of sorts and he would he had these speakers and this um pioneer sx 1050 that he used in various situations, both of these. Not necessarily together, but whatever the case. And, I mean, as you can see, these are in really, really crappy boxes. Like, these aren't these aren't the boxes that are designed for them. They're just generic 15-inch uh, boxes for 15-inch drivers. And uh, they're built really crappily. I mean, just look at that crap. I don't even know what that is. Whatever. Um, and as you can see, one of them has a thing blocking the port, and the other one doesn't. So what I ended up doing was I screwed a uh, just a, I cut a piece of wood to size and just screwed it over there because they, they they sound different. Trust me. Um, but yeah, that's kind of. The thing with those and of course they don't extend that high even though they are technically referred to as full range or well extended range at least so what I have here is a pair of realistic minimus fives but the woofers are blown in both of them and the tweeter is not original in fact 
that inside there is a 99 cent Mylar tweeter from Parts Express. So, really, it's it's a crappy tweeter, but I mean, it sounds all, it sounds all right, uh, especially in that in the waveguide there. And that just goes into the speaker B or whatever of the amp, blah blah blah. And that's kind of how this how the setup is right here. And the I'm gonna be honest with you, these things sound freaking incredible. Like the sound stage, like I you I hear stuff coming from you know over there and like whatever just next to me or almost behind me. And then the imaging is just is also like insane. Like you you get the feeling that there is a speaker there. Well, actually, technically, it would be kind of right where the center channel is. So it sounds like the center channel is on, but it's not even. Uh, those are the speakers to the home theater setup. So that's that's a completely separate thing. Um, and that, I mean that's, I mean that that alone just makes these extremely nice to listen and listen to. And I mean they make you just want to keep turning it up and just. But, obviously, you get to the point where the boxes start to shake themselves to bits. So, the loudest I was playing... That's about the loudest I was playing. I could play... I, Jesus. English. Um, that's about as loud as I can play these... What I... The demo clips there. Um, yeah, this, this SX-1050 we had restored. This is a beautiful... Uh, looking and sounding receiver. And it's got all your tone controls and it's all everything basically. And it's it's like an amazing vintage receiver basically. So I mean that's that's really all there is to it. And you know, quite lucky to own these because these are actually you know relatively high, even though they're in crappy boxes paired with crappy tweeters. They're quite high end, uh, quite high end speakers actually, uh, vintage speakers. They you may see. You know, Ken, may, many of you may know the company Kenrick Sound. They're based in Japan. They get a lot of these and they restore them. And they sound amazing. So, I wish I could get my set restored and in proper boxes with proper tweeters. But, you know, one can only dream. So, for now, uh, some of the best speakers. Maybe even the best speakers that I own currently. This This setup right here. I mean, so that's really about it. So... Thanks for watching this video, and more videos to come soon. I mean, I've been pretty busy lately, so I haven't had time to make a lot of videos. Like, home theater area, i got to make a few videos on that, because a few things have changed. But other than that, yep, I mean, that's about it. So, thanks for watching.